Oh, hello, Isla. I have come to read you a book. I'm hoping I can do this every week. So I'm going to read you a book and Mummy's going to give you the phone so that you can watch it. My girlfriend is an artist and she paints pictures and her daughter Allie writes stories and they wrote a really good book all about girls. So I'm going to read it to you. Here we go. A girl can have short hair, tiny curls, messy or combed. A girl can have short hair. A girl can be graceful as a bird or strong as a bear. Sometimes a girl might be gentle like a summer breeze and she can also be fierce with the might of a lioness. A girl can choose to sit and watch, but if she wants to play, she can. And she can be the best, but that's not even the goal. Like a teddy, a girl could be cuddly. Other days, she might be prickly as a porcupine. A girl can follow the rules, but you know what? She can also make the rules. Yesterday, she might have been silent. Today, perhaps, she is the steady rhythm of a beating drum. Tomorrow, the crashing waves of the ocean. A girl might be resting safe and sound under her bed sheets, or wild and free like a jungle animal. I think the second one is more like you. A girl can watch the world from the mountain peaks or feel the dip of her paddle in the still lake below. A tiger, her roar may echo through the trees. A mouse, she may tiptoe across the fields. A girl can have the spark of a firecracker, or like a candle flame, she can softly give light. A girl can be all of these things as long as she is true to herself. The end. See you next week. Bye-bye.